BlackBerry give us the possibility to test the Bolt, yourarmcellularmagazine.it, and Emilio Mina Piano. This is just a press kit, so it's not what you will find in the box that depends on the operator and on the BlackBerry of your country. Here was the phone, some paper, travel charger, mini USB of course, some adapter, a micro SD, one gig, a letter of ring, Headphones, stereo, a bit cheap, I have to say. They are not so nice. USB sync and recharge cable. Instruction. In Italian, of course. Other paper, paper, that's all. Let's go to the ball. The sign are big as you can see. In fact we have 140 millimeter per 66 per 14 millimeter of thick. The screen is amazing. It's a, a HVGA screen with a great resolution of 480 per 320. This is the first time that BlackBerry gave a resolution so huge in uh, one of his smartphones. Of course it's uh, not only a quadriband GSM, GPRS and H but it's also UMTS and HSDPA. It's a three band UMTS 2100 1,900, 850. So you can do your UMTS almost all around the world. The memory inside is uh, one gigabyte of internal memory, but it's not flash memory. It's just 128 for your application. The weight is more than 100 grams, so it's not so light. Let's go on the phone. First of all, of course you have the Perl here, application menu and the QWERTY. QWERTY cables is amazing. I hope you can see how they design all the keys. You have two different lines so you can easily push with two thumbs but also you can Bright with one thumb. It's more difficult, of course, but you can do. You get used so easily to this QWERTY that really you will love how fast, how precise is the typing. On the right side of the phone, you find the balance of the volume, the camera key, that the main camera is on the back. It's a 2 megapixel camera with LED flash, no autofocus unfortunately. Inside you have a battery that is pretty pretty huge, 1500 milliampere per hour. Lithium of course, microphone on the bottom, left side you have the 3.5 millimeter jack micro USB for charging and sync, voice command, micro SD slot. On the top you can turn off the ringtone, you can have vibration or silence, depends on you, and here the speaker. The audio is pretty pretty good, not only when you use the phone mode but also when you use the speaker. Here you have a lot of status when you receive an email, when you receive a message, something turning off, but also there is the light sensor on the bottom, so 
the screen just adapts and also the QWERTY light turns on and off. Inside you have the latest BlackBerry software, it's 4.6, so it's now that we update a few days ago, it's very stable, it really works nicely, the graphics are, are good, the browser is the new one, so is adapting with zoom in, zoom out. Let's go to a page. We are over the VLAN of the office, so Okay, this is pretty look like what you see on the web. You have the magnifier lens that helps you to go inside the menus, to help go inside all the content that you have in the page. Everything was it's optimized, everything goes very fast. classical mail menu as you see we are on Wi-Fi I disconnect from the mobile network instead email will come over and over application every application works pretty fine for this phone some teams are not so optimized still but they are making their time The media part has been updated. Now you can you can sync your iTunes songs with your BlackBerry, but also you can see streaming videos. You can see you can see streaming video in that area. Ringtones are better quality. Images are. Some of the pre-charge images can really show how powerful is the screen. Let's go here. Resolution is amazing. On this phone you have also Wi-Fi, as we see here, the icon, but also GPS, in fact you have Maps application. And it's coming in Italy with a price of 465 Euro. That's all for cellularemagazine.it, Emilio Vignapiano with the Blackberry Bolt.